So we had conducted the training of trainers on smart farming to the smart farmers who are the extension agent of uh, the blocks of two uh, districts, Punaka and Wangdi, and researchers and academicians from the Royal University of Bhutan. When this TOT was conducted, we had resource person from within the consortium, Associate Professor Claudine Gay, Professor Sylvain uh, Touchard from University of Lumeri, France, and uh, Dr. Pavina uh, Subo Sombot from Chiang Mai University, Thailand, Ms. Kalpana Karki from uh, Acme Engineering College from Nepal, and Mr. Jimmy Tinle, uh, Mr. Gembo Namgel, Mr. Shilhamo, and myself uh, from the Royal University of Bhutan. DOT on the installation of smart farming technologies was carried out from the 6th to the 12th of June 2022. The training was given to seven academicians of the College of Natural Resources at the college itself. The training focused on the hands-on installation of an automated agrometeorological station and smart irrigation system. Theory inputs were given before the practicals by the resource person, Dr. Sering Penchur. The training was done to build the capacity of academicians. Also, theory inputs on different topics were given to the participants by the consortium partners through online mode, smart monitoring, control and automation by Dr. Pavina, agro-business, business modeling by Dr. Claudine Gay, digital agriculture, data capture, storage and transfer by Dr. Andras Gabor, standardization by Dr. Sylvian Tachat, Agro Health and Safety by Dr. Keshir Prasan, an orientation to e-learning platform by Sufong Sin Bumrong. Presentations on the quality pilot, organic pilot, cattle pilot, and working in health condition pilot were made by Ms. Ugin Yangchin, Dr. Pradhan Surifong, Dr. Krita Ponsomat, and Dr. Keshir Prasan, respectively. Farmers training on smart farming was carried out from the 23rd to the 24th of August 2022. There was a total of 26 participants, 24 educated farmers from Bunaka and Wangdi districts and two non-teaching staff from the College of Natural Resources. The training was given at the college by resource persons Ms. Ugin Yangchen, Ms. Sring Yangzom and Mr. Nado, an extension agent from Nahi Gyok of Wangdi district. The training was conducted to build the capacity of the participants. <laughs> Sensor Gilo, Anzum, the Haramago, the Chigi Hablu Jamsitondi, and the baby, the Nadi Anzumbe. She to be born, the Haramago, the Shudola, the Anigi, and the Luda, Fugina, the Gnassa Pendi Tony Mess, the Shudola. The labor shortage, you know, Anni, the Dangajina, me, the Milovi, News of Indiani, the Anisuke, cover of Jenny Mess, the Nora Belgian, the Dutumaji. Changla jam chichap to la changla de namsme sabji mambe sugi so da de ani venga chira migi lama so chimna me kami ansum bo de ani technology ki de namse pen thoni me se shudo na me mambe se lo bo de. The resource persons covered topics such as the installation of an automated weather station, smart irrigation, evaporative cooling pad system, smart farming in Bhutan, soil fertility management, and finally, pest and disease management. Hands-on practice on the weather station, smart irrigation, evaporative cooling pad system, and soil pH and EC sensors were done. मचे फाम दा धन्ना बा स्मार्ट फार्मिंग गे पानकों गे खेबरदे तांफु व्यवचिंग अचरा तेता शिंखलु लाचि बेवा जोदि बेरो हे तेलां दा तोसे बा छिछे गे तेचाशिस दिसुन कने मिनुला दा तारे नाबा मचरा स्मार्ट फार्मिंग ट्रेनिंग नलु तेता तिनाले कचरा न्यमयों कचरा थोपचि सवाजिन तेता मिशनरी ते इक्विपमेंट्स अनि अचरा चर्चे दिसो लेवल फोल्ड्स अच्छी मा माफ़ चम्म निकी तो लेवल ते नम समय रो कैचुक दिसो की जोड़ी की वे दूर से शुनिला
Uh, my name is Jimmy Sering, and just now I'm running an organic farm. And after joining the, the training on uh, smart farming for sustainable agriculture, And it is going to be one of better agriculture farming practices in the future for accurate weather conditions. Uh, like we can grow everything on time, like after recording all the weather conditions. And these are going to be uh, one of uh, big uh, achievements in the future agriculture.